The EU continues to delegate the management of its borders to third countries, even if it means allying itself with controversial governments, argues Adrian Bertin. The EU passed an anti-migration deal with Egypt in March, and the timing is no accident. The European Union fears a massive influx of Palestinian refugees, fleeing the massacres perpetrated by the IDF in Gaza, explains the French media outlet Politis. Egyptians themselves could be affected by the agreement, explains Claudio Francavilla of NGO Human Rights Watch, quoted by Green European Journal. In fact, the surveillance technology provided to the government could be used for internal surveillance and targeting of opponents. The EU is already considering another agreement with Lebanon, where some Syrian migrants take refuge before departing for Cyprus. For Nicosia, defining certain regions of the country ravaged by civil war as safe would enable the authorities to repatriate their citizens, Reuters explains.